Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to push Wi-Fi profiles to end devices using Intune or Endpoint Manager. So here I am logged into intune.microsoft.com and what I need to do is go to devices and configuration and simply say create a new policy. Now here you can decide what platform you want to use, maybe a uh, uh, iPhones or maybe Androids, but for this demo, I'm going to do the Windows 10 or later. Then I'm going to select templates. If you scroll down to the end, you can select Wi Fi and say create. Now, here you just have to give it a name. Let's call it uh, Wi Fi. Next. So whether it's basic or enterprise, you have to decide what's this. So if you go to basic, it's really just entering the information. And if it's enterprise, it's the same thing. You have to basically enter the information. And, uh, you know, so I'm going to call it uh, Wi-Fi company connection name Wi-Fi company. This uh, option is connect automatically within range, yes or no. It'll say yes, connect to more preferred network if available, yes or no, and connect if the broad if it's not broadcast broadcasting, that's up to you. You can pick these uh, options. Wireless security type, is it open? Of course, no one does open these days, so it's WPAW2 personal or enterprise because we picked basic, it's given us only the personal. But if we picked enterprise here, it'll be different. Oh, it deleted everything. Unrestricted. And the password and say next. We're not going to do tags, which is going to go to assignment. Now, the assignment really depends on your uh, need. So you can add it to all users or all devices or a group of devices or a group of users. Now, bear in mind, if you added it to all users, every time that user is going to log in with a new device, that profile is going to be pushed. However, if you added it only to devices, that device would, would, uh, would, would get the profile once. And if the user logged in with a different device that's not part of this, those devices, they'll not get it. So usually, we just, uh, you know, it depends on the need you would choose. Or if you can choose to uh, to, add, to push it to a group of users, you can also add a group. And if you want to exclude a group by adding it to all users and then exclude a, gr a group, you can also do that. So we're going to basically assign it to, gr to a group and say next. Now, once you assign it, if you want to create rules, like, uh, for example, assign this profile if the OS edition or the OS version, for example, Windows 10, 11 enterprise only. This way you can only assign it basically to a specific machines or you can do without it. It's, it's really uh, your choice. And then uh, next and simply create it. Once you create this rule, all the people that you assigned it to would be getting this rule. It's as simple as that. And uh, thank you very much for watching. Please, please remember to like and subscribe to the channel for more content like this. And have a good day.